Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Gong Du on Legendary Difficulty. Where last time we left off, we were attacking some armies belonging to Lady Liu. In fact, we are attacking Lady Liu, so that's nice. Um, we are going to make this a night battle. That was the whole plan: is that we were going to attack this initial army, make it a night battle, and then move in Gong Du's army in Force March stance. Um, and then we fight the other army with 2v1 basically, because both armies had run away already. So this is actually low losses, I could probably auto resolve this one, but let's just fight it manually, which is what's, what's the plan last time. And to lose as few men here as possible, because again, I have a second battle to do afterwards as well. So I don't want to lose as many, or I don't want to lose too many men. I'm going to try to lose not too many men, at least. And then we got a second battle waiting for us, and then I don't know what we've got waiting for us actually. Many more battles, I'm sure. This campaign is just battle after battle after battle. I'm wondering if that's what every Yellow Turban campaign is going to be like, but I guess we'll find out over the years or over the months, however long it's going to take to do all those campaigns. All those campaigns. Alright, you guys. No flaming shots. Alright, well. That sucks, isn't it? Okay, I can currently... Wait, let me just put you up there. Give me more vision. More vision! There we go, alright. All the calves on the left side. So I'm gonna put my calf both on this side. Alright, something along those lines. Um, am I gonna have all four of my calf on one side again as well? Just ignore the calf. I think that works out alright, to be honest. Alright. Partially left. Oh, yeah, I might want to pull you back. <laughs> that would have been pretty awkward, actually. I just left him up there. Totally forget about him. Alright. Ooh, I don't have vision. Oh, shit. I don't actually have vision on anything over there. I'm going to waste quite a few shots not having any vision. I guess there is a bit of a, a hill. I feel like I, I'd still hear, hear the clamor, but I guess hearing is not the same as seeing, is it? Okay, well, we see a unit, but that's not a unit I want to fire at. Alright, well, we're firing at it, so... There you go. Oh, that was moderately successful, actually. There we go. I'm gonna keep the focus just these units, please. There we go. That's a lot of units right there. Uh, no, I don't think I will. This is a no, I'm not interested. No, thank you, sir. I will not be taking that challenge today. Does anyone want to duel you? Uh, the somewhat wounded person with the ones. They're both somewhat wounded, actually. Actually, they're both somewhat dead. You're not particularly great at dueling, but you can probably make it happen. Keep you nearby for the armor, keep you nearby for the heal. Yeah, sorry. Sai. Um, yes. I'll take that, but I'll take it over here somewhere if you don't mind. So I run away, do your old cheeky runaway tactic where he's gonna follow me now. If you follow me now, take away the biggest part of me. There we go. Alright, now we run that way again, everyone. Run, boys! Wait, where's my dude at? There he is, okay. Follow him! Jules gonna be right there, perfect. Got the first bout as well, perfect. Alright, so you just want to keep your armor bonus nearby, and you want to use the heal at some point. Alright. My cavalry. Let's get over here. So you have no actual active things to do except for the heal. At some point. Make sure these guys are in position, because if we're moving while they charge me... Take a lot of damage. I think we're gonna be alright though. Uh, this is a bit awkward now. Attack her, please. You know what? Infantry, just get in there. Okay, we are stationary there. Perfect. Just fucking make your way over here, boys. Cav, there's not really many archers left for me to murder. The army already ran away, so I don't have to worry about that either. Just get into this blob, really. Alright, Cav did indeed get wrecked, so that's all good. We actually took quite a bit of losses, right? quite a few losses there. You guys are doing alright, you can do the morale debuff on her, I suppose. 
Take this. I can slap her so fucking hard. So fucking hard. <clears throat> Sorry. Alright, get over here. Hey everyone! Get over here! Right, you're back in full HP. No, you're not. That's the other person's HP. I oh, know, she's gone mad because of friendship. Stop moving, friendship lady. Oh, okay. For a second I thought it didn't even work. Slap her. Slap her up the fucking side of the head. Alright, can we get a master out here, please? I mean, what is this? Really? I want to use the heal as well, but I want to wait until she's gone. I think she's uh, unbreakable. So are her fucking units, apparently. They're not actually, but it certainly looks like it. There we go. Alright, now we should hopefully see a route from these two units as well. One can only imagine. There we go. Alright, gee. Good shit. Second battle, let's do it. Uh, yeah. Even that unit got two kills. Impressive. Alright, so that's her. She's not actually... Wait, she's dead. Even though she's... I thought she had... She's legendary, so she should have more lives. Wait, who's gonna take over the fa this faction now? Um... I don't know. Am I gonna take the replenishment or the money? I can't need money right now. Uh, oh, she's not actually dead then, is she? Lady Liu, no, she's fine. Even though it said she died. She didn't die. And also, because that army moved that way. No, I called Reach, are you kidding me? You're actually kidding me. Because the army moved away. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, well. Uh, he can't really go far, I don't think, because my circles are going to block him in. The main thing is that... No, yeah, now he can't actually go anywhere except into the river, which he could he could just go across the river and attack me here or something. Or maybe he'll just go into encampment stance, which would be okay, because then we still have a lot of trebuchets. Yeah, it was awkward. Uh, um, it looked like it was going to be really good, the fact that he moved, because it meant that he wouldn't have to go into force march stance to, meet, to reinforce. But it also meant that he couldn't even reach and attack the army anymore, so that kind of sucked. Right, this over here, we are receiving this next turn, right? Yeah. I wonder if they're gonna come back and try and save it. I hope so. Oh, I hope so. I certainly hope so. I got some money. So, we'll just recruit a bunch of these boys. Okay, let's... Do it that way around then. Because I want to keep these guys eventually. In this army anyway, so... Okay. So, well, I need to replenish for a while, but we would have that covered. Although, yeah, against an army like this, we're gonna get totally destroyed one-on-one. -on -one. We just can't... Like, our units can't beat this, our generals can't beat this. We need He Yi or... Well, pr preferably, we'd need... Um, Pei Yuan Xiao and Huang Xiao over here, but that's not gonna happen. It's, they're just too far away. This army might be able to get over there, though, but it's probably too busy over here, and this one's gonna be too busy dealing with shit around here, and... blah 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 boop uh, what is our chance of peace of you now? We haven't really fought you yet, so... Yeah, still ter terrible. Absolutely terrible. What are we at here? 5.1. Wow, that's going up so slowly. Does anyone want to submit to me now? Well, you know. Can still support Vassal Independence, but we're actually becoming massive mates with Yuan... Yuan Xiao. <laughs> Yuan Xiu, even. I mean, we're not really, let's be honest, but... How much is this worth to you? It's much Jojo Bamba? That is quite a lot. Um, have you any need for food? Yes, the thing is, you probably haven't got any money, do you? No, not really. Nope. That's never gonna be worth it. How about just an instant bit of cash? Five grand. What say you? What say you? Two grand for ten food and military access. It's not a lot, is it? That's not a lot at all. 
2262. Oh, it's 20 food, actually. I misread that altogether. No, yeah, never mind. That's not gonna happen. I'm sorry. So sorry. Uh, Kong Rong, you are usually incredibly rich. I'm already giving you food. Oh! That's where my food is. I'm supplying him with 26 food. Also, right, I remember, I was gonna check this yesterday. Well, last time I recorded, which for me was yesterday. Yeah, we're still five turns away. I feel like we initiated this, like... This was a seven-turn thing. <laughs> and we initiated it, like, three episodes ago, or four episodes ago, and we were still only two turns. This is ridiculous. There's so many battles in this campaign, it's mental. Anyway, okay, so we're playing Kong Rong with food. I think that was maybe for getting peace of him or something now. Uh, but yeah, that's good to know, because I, I, now I know where my food has gone. Does anyone else want food? You're very poor in food and eat one money. Oh, we're at war with you. That doesn't help. Uh, I mean, to be fair, we're at war with just about everyone on this entire fucking list. There's Kong Rong Li, uh, Wang Lang. There's two vassals of uh, Yuan Shu. We're not, actually, yeah, we're not war with Yuan Shu. But we already just checked you. You don't have any money. Um, the Han Empire, we are already receiving food from, of course. Uh, you want food? Yama. You actually have food. The more, the better question is, do you have any money that you'd be willing to give me? 2.4 start is not terrible, but it's still not great. No, it's never going to be worth it. Uh, Taobo. Oh, you want to join my military alliance? Oh, can I join your military alliance is what that is. It's a pretty... Um, Oh, I can actually see their numbers on that too. Alright, fuck it, we can't sell this food. Um, we're not really, you know, lusting for money or anything either. We're actually pretty okay on the money front right now. What the fuck did you just say to me? Alright, I'm not gonna have to worry about that. Although, to be fair, since it's just those units right now... Could she beat that? Recruit the other dude in here, maybe? Shinpu. Yeah. Surely those two will be able to do this. Oh wow, it's actually a close victory. Evenly matched. I'm gonna say that's a bunch of baloney boys. Let's do it. Fight them manually. Watch me lose this now. If you lose this now. That would actually be kind of annoying, because I kind of want these two generals around for being able to recruit them wherever I need them. There's actually no real reason to attack this either, but if I do it now, I'll just finish them off. However, having said that, that'll probably mean they're just going to recruit more dudes back in in their town, which doesn't really help me either. Also, interesting, archers normally always ignore generals, but now, since um, there's nothing they can fire at besides my generals, Yep, they're going to be firing at my generals. Alright, I mean... Oh, they were in Force March too, fantastic. Our success looms large. There we go. Alright. We got this. Kill that unit off. Oh no, those few men got away. I don't know if that matters at all, actually. Alright. I'll claim my victory. Apparently it was close. I lost zero men. Close victory. <laughs> How does it actually determine HP on your generals in, in a situation like that? Alright. 0% replenishment, I'll take the money then, Alright, that means I can get rid of you guys. Not that it cost me anything to have you around, but... Also, I gave her a bunch of items, but I didn't do that to him yet. I'm assuming also that that doesn't... No, that doesn't re reset my seasonal deployments. Like, it'd be interesting if you recruit someone and then the, um, dismiss them right away. Does that give you back your uh, regional deployments? But it clearly doesn't. Also, this okay. army, unfortunately, I didn't really think about this, could just attack one of my armies and then I run away, they'd, they'd be able to attack me again. So I might, I might be blocking it in right now, but that's kind of pointless. 
充实巨岩，嗯，廉洁奉公，忍受苦难，不露声色。See, the problem is if he has night battle available, which I probably don't know if he does. He does. Okay, so we don't want to we don't want to mar uh, force march run to our army because then he'll just attack us one at a time. So we'll just have to hope that one of our armies will be enough, and that there's no other armies lurking around for me here because that would actually really suck. So while this really should have been a clear victory for me with no problems whatsoever, it turned into this really awkward situation. Where there could be an army coming from the other side, and it would double team this army, and there's nothing I can do about it. And that would suck. But there's only one way to find out whether that happens or not. Alright, Liu Bei. Where are all your armies at? Oh, they're sailing around, okay. There's that other one being annoying. Oh, I fucking knew it too. See, that's so dumb. If I lose this army now, it'll actually just be the game fucking me over. Try and retreat, but it's probably not going to be enough. Oh, it was enough. Cao Cao's back, hello. He's trying to take his Imperial seat back, I guess. Ah, and he did come back. That's perfect. It means I can start sieging him out. Oh, God. Oh, shit, there's an army there. Okay. Hey, Lady Liu did die. And now it's Yuan Shang who's taken over. Oh, they're taking attrition. They have taken attrition already. Perfect. It's kind of surprised that they didn't actually follow me all the way, but hey, what do you want? Uh, this guy is at war with the Han Empire now. Okay. Uh, I will pay the ransom. I don't even know who that is, but I'm sure it's someone I need. Is it this guy? No, it wasn't. All right, I'm ready for duty. A couple of dudes. Yeah, because there's a situation. I mean, the biggest current one that happened was here, which is a rather small army. So I think we'll be okay here if I recruit one or two generals. Pussy. Can you keep take that right now? Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, this, this movement is really not helping me, is it? Uh, you're gonna go attack this town here first and foremost. Oh. Ooh, that's a pretty solid army too. Uh, this one got all the experience except for on the infantry units, but overall. Not a huge deal. However, of course, this is a situation we saw before, is that their garrisons, of course, consists, uh, cons consists of these units, which means that their army is actually really good. They've got regular crossbowmen too, a bunch of uh, spear guards, which are really good. This is actually a pretty solid army, but we're going to have to do it, because I'm not going to be able to get a second army over here, so this will just have to happen. Hopefully they don't sally out and they'll let me siege them out, but that's not going to happen. All right, uh, yep, level two towns and stuff I do want to upgrade. However, probably recruiting another army right now, so. Charitable. Interesting. I created for Dong Sheng. I don't know who that is. Okay. So you want to upgrade that town, and this town is the other one that upgraded, I think. Yunman? Yun, Yun Yunnan. Yun Yun oh, yeah, it's Yunnan, okay. Right, here. This will be a, a tough one as well, because the garrison there will also, of course, help the army. Ooh, the army is in Force March stance, but I'm assuming I can't actually attack it right now. Well, oh, I can. Okay, well, that might be what I have to do then. It'll still be both the armies, but at least this one's a Force March stance. It's also not entirely full. Those two units, you know, that, that does count. Um, <clears throat> okay, so you are going like a madman this way. I might need to help out around here, to be honest. If I attack him, he's going to run away into an annoying point again where I can't catch him. There's also Cao Cao. But of course, since this is my Imperial seat now, I actually get an incredibly good garrison. <clears throat> Not quite as good as the other ones, because we don't have Defenders of Earth and Protectors of Heaven available. But this is still a good garrison. Plus, I built the garrison building, so I don't think he can ever do anything. Especially with this mostly dead army, to be honest. Um, I don't know where you're going to go, to be honest. Definitely somewhere. I'm going to handle that situation as well. Okay, fuck me. I got so many decisions to make right now. Assuming that... No, yeah, they're reinforcing me, so it doesn't happen. You're, yeah, just fine replenishing for the moment. Why couldn't you get calf? Oh, I couldn't afford the calf. That was... Okay, I didn't actually... Alright, I'm an idiot. 
I didn't waste that much money though, to be fair. But yeah, I'm an idiot. I didn't realize that this army actually could recruit the cav. I just because this is the army that can't. I just assumed they were both unable. Anyway, anyway. Um, See, so yeah, I feel like this army is more threatening than that small one. If I attack this one though, they're just gonna run away as well past the river, and I won't be able to catch them. So I may have to do the old strategy of cheesing which isn't really cheese because the game is cheese in and of itself by not letting you attack okay see so you I don't know because if I go if I go over here we're getting very far away from the like he's gonna kind of push through whereas we're still way far behind over here so if we go that way there could just be an army going that way from here and there's nothing we can do about it maybe after we dealt with this which will possibly be this turn we will be able to catch up on this side at least and we can kind of see what's going on over here so we can at least make sure there's nothing coming from this way or we can even send one of the armies down this way to go here whereas the other one keeps going up here but there's both Gong Xinzan as well as the Kingdom of Wei as well as Lady Liu who is not Lady Liu anymore but anyway Yuan Shao's faction uh, Yuan Shang so there are three different enemies up here um, so yeah, Her Yi, I'm kind of wondering, do I need him here now? Because these armies appear to just going to be kind of roaming around. Or do I need to have him help out over here first? I think for the moment, I guess, yeah, whatever we do, just go in this general direction for now. We can run again, normal speed. And then we can either help deal with this stuff over here, or we can still decide to send him down this way. So that'll be the plan with him. You're definitely doing a battle there. Gonna be a tough one, but it's winnable. Although this is a completely inexperienced army. Do we even have blowy uppy shots? We do not. Blowy uppy shots. That was the name I gave it, wasn't it? Right, you can't do jack, unfortunately. I'm going to recruit a single general in here. Um, and no more than that, because I need the other three regional deployments for getting the rest of the army, or the next army, basically. Um, so yeah, we're sieging out here, they're probably gonna sally, and I don't know if I can deal with that, but we're gonna darn well try. Uh, I could alternatively go into Liberation Stand and try and make it rebel, but that's probably not gonna happen either. Right, if I'm gonna recruit another army, where would that be? I feel like I don't necessarily need one around here, but I could still use one to push through faster. I mean, that's this army's goal right now, but... This doesn't even have a garrison right now, because I... Well, it will do next turn. It'll just be almost dead. But yeah, that army could come this way. I think we're still gonna go towards this small town, even though we can't quite reach it right now. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, we knew now, didn't we? Well, their replenishment's pretty trash. Oh my god, they got infantry of Jing, even though it's... Oh yeah, of course they do, because this used to be Liu Biao's army. Okay. Just walk an extra six feet, come on! Look at that fucking nonsense. Alright. Um, yeah, you guys are just gonna hang out. There's not really much... I mean, I want them to attack me. I can't go on the offensive with these armies, because for one... Well, I mean, they would be okay enough to do it, even though we don't have blow you up a shot. Um, it's more that we'd have to deal with a garrison as well. I need to be on the defensive here and wait for the, the actual armies to show up and do something. Um, you, I'm almost tempted to send back this way, just to stop Cao Cao. Yeah, I mean, he can't take that, but he could possibly be annoying and attack other places. I think I'm just going to send you this way and attack the regional city of Dong, which is going to take much more food again. But so be it. Maybe someone will turn back and deal with that. Right, so there's not really any progression right now. We just have a whole bunch of battles waiting for us. And by a whole bunch, I mean two. Which isn't really a whole bunch. And I gotta think about where I'm gonna recruit an army, but I guess I'll do the battles first and then we'll see how much money we got after that. Right, so starting with this one. This is actually gonna be a tough one. We don't have blowy up a shot here. We also only have one trebuchet, as realized. I didn't recruit a second one here. That was a mistake. Um This army isn't forced march stance, which is our only saving grace. It's a decisive defeat as well, I'm not even fucking close. Alright, this army is mostly inexperienced, and it's, it's missing those two units. Um, we have... Yeah, we got the heal, which automatically just makes everyone so much better. Even got the buff there. Yeah, this army is alright. It's, it's missing some experience. We don't have blowy up shot, we only have one trebuchet, but... It's not too bad. Let's do it. The main thing is, they're in force march... Or in march stance, so they'll be exhausted. 
Although, having said that, March Dance doesn't really make a huge difference, or being exhausted doesn't really make a huge difference in Romance mode, but it still helps to some degree. Uh, reinforcements are coming from behind me, and the reinforcements are the garrison, which are a lot smaller, so I think I'm actually going to try and take them down immediately. It's kind of an awkward battlefield here, unfortunately. Basically going to have to put ourselves in this forest here. Ugh, I don't know about that. I kind of have to. How large is the garrison? It's too large for me to just attack it with uh, cavalry and generals, isn't it? Hmm. We're not going to be able to see any of them. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to have to just fight this one. Where is the end of the map? All the way over here. We will fight them on the beaches. Yeah, I'm going to have to go back and fight them all at the same time. It just It's not going to work. It's too... This, this map is too densely forested and there's too much I can't see because of the trees. Uh, and it's too slopey and it's just... Yeah. It's just, yeah. So I'm gonna have to go back and just uh, meet them all on this beach here. Kind of corner camping it, I'll admit, but not really intended to be. Uh, you know what, I'll keep all the cab on one side, I think. Mostly because they'll probably come from all over the damn place. Uh, also, I'm attacking them, so there's actually a chance that they will just sit back and I'll never know it. So I'm going to have to get a general up there and send you over there. Because there is a chance they'll actually just sit back. This could actually be, end up being an incredibly annoying battle to fight. I'm hoping it won't be, but I'm fearing for it right now. Pretty important there. I, I turned them around the other way. Yeah, that's kind of corner campy, but not intended. I'll probably move up a little bit once we've got everything there. But yeah, you're just gonna have to kind of see if we can find them first and foremost. And if they're coming towards me, because if they're just gonna sit back, I'm gonna have to attack them at some point, which makes this... It's gonna make this a very long battle. Because it'll take a long time for my trebuchet to get up there. Thank fuck it's not snowing. But having these turns be so damn long means that... Um, snow only ever happens once every five fucking episodes. If they're right here... Okay, there you go. Uh, they appear to be sitting back, although that could be because they're waiting for their reinforcements to show. I also... Ugh, God. I, I'm gonna have to keep this guy up here. If if I have to attack them and I move my army up this way, I'm gonna have to keep this guy up here just so I can actually see them. Because I couldn't see them until I got over this little ledge, basically. <sighs> Fuck me. Alright, well, I don't know if they're coming or not, but... This is such an awkward battle. It's gonna be such an annoying battle to fight as well, just simply because we're on a fucking hill. On a downward slope. Um... Damn it, camera, please. On a downward slope, we can't see shit, there's too much forest, it's just... It's gonna be an incredibly awkward battle to fight this one. But hopefully now that their reinforcements have arrived, they will actually just come towards me, in which case I can move my army back again. But it currently doesn't look like it. All their cav also... Actually, no, they've got... Oh, fucking hell, they've got lots of cav, holy shit. That actually is not good. Please just come towards me, I have a trebuchet. Thank fuck I didn't bring two trebuchets, that's fine. I'm almost tempted to run away here, this is gonna be such an awkward battle. Because I'm, I'm attacking on this fucking map. When do you ever see a map like this? Only when I'm attacking, this is unbelievable. Alright, please get into position and just come toward, more, moving towards me. Start moving. Please do it. I have a trebuchet. Please. Which I, by the way, actually got into position yet. Yeah, they're not coming. Fucking hell, this is gonna be the most awkward battle I've ever fought. I don't wanna attack from this angle. I literally don't. 
I am tempted to just run away and let this be, and let them just attack me in normal stance. This is going to be so awkward. I honestly don't know if I can win this, just because of how... Look at the steepness of this hill. Like, look at this shit. We're just going to get destroyed by the cavalry charges. Yeah, fuck it. You know what? I'm out of here. Fuck you, game. I'm not playing by your rules. Oh, they were moving, but now they're not anymore. Drop that shit. Let's get out of here. I am playing by your rules, game. You can suck my... Don't cool. Let's get out of here, boys. Call it a draw, call it a defeat, I don't give a shit. Sand. Do we actually any movement bonuses for that? Or reduction? No. Maybe for cav or something? Doesn't look like it. We're losing ground. No, we're losing, guys. Oh no, what happened? Everyone's running into the sea. <laughs> <laughs> Watch my entire army be dead because they ran into the sea. Uh, that's actually kind of funny. Decisive defeat. All right. Apparently, when you withdraw from a siege, it's a it's a draw. You know, it's in the word withdraw. But apparently, if you run away from a battle like this, it's actually just a loss. Decisive loss as well. Wow. Wait. Oh my God! <laughs> they captured one of my dudes and he let him be. Thank fuck for that. I didn't think about that. Oh, they lost. Oh my god, I lost an ancillary. But I did. That's so dumb. That's like the shittiest fucking mechanic ever. What the fuck is that? I ran away. How can they take shit from me when I'm not even there anymore? Oh, that was such a good item too. You're kidding me, man. Oh, that's unbelievable. <sighs> Literally anything else would have been greater than taking that. All right, fine, whatever. Can't believe that shit. I'm losing against am I supplies lost after defeat. Are you fucking kidding me right now? This is such a joke. I don't want to see this shit anymore. Ah, oh, that is just the dumbest thing. Alright, let's just let's do this other battle. This should be more fun, hopefully. Um, okay, I don't want to move you very far, so I'm gonna move you into range of this army. Let's want to attack that one. Let's say attack that one. Okay, now I can't actually move until this town is besieged. So. Um. Let's well as well bring this army over a little bit. It should be enough. It is. Alright, low losses. Do I fight this one? I probably should. Still want to lose as few men as possible, so fine, I'll fight this one. So I have possibly three battles waiting for me here. Although, unfortunately, because these armies keep running away, I may not have the movement to kill both. I probably have this 1v1 in each army instead of 2v1ing both. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to reach it. So the He Yi, well, not the He Yi, this healer guy who looks like He Yi, Shang Fang, is going to have to fight the one on the right, the smaller army. And then Gong Du is going to fight the one that has. Um, he's going to have to fight the one that has the. Uh, the armies, or the units loop, uh, losing, uh, leaving. Sorry, I can't speak because I'm so fucking focused. Uh, what am I doing up front? I'm not going for the Game of Thrones strat today. Yeah, that last battle kind of pissed me off. After playing it so well the entire time, the game rewards me with a shitty map like that. I run away and I somehow lose, which, you know, whatever, that's all fine. But because I lose, I lose one of my best ancillaries in the entire army. That's pretty rough. I mean, I have a bazillion ancillaries, but not really good ones like that. That was like six expertise and six uh, resolve. That's so good. It's like honestly quite the bummer. Uh, yeah, they're coming. Alright, so fire at that hole, please. Is this another one where they're gonna come towards that reinforcing army? Kind of awkwardly for me. This is the insane amount of calf garrison, also. Uh, have we even. Okay, yeah, we've done some damage, it looks like, but not a whole lot.
Okay, this has been somewhat pathetic so far from these things. What the hell? Is this gonna be another shitty battle? I don't know. Just gonna go over here for now. Saber infantry, not even militia. Oh god, it's gonna be another annoying battle. Luckily these are all spears, so they wanna charge in there, they're gonna get absolutely destroyed. Luckily for the for me, they haven't really got much else they can charge into. Damn it, I didn't even reach that unit. Not that it really matters. Uh, also, trebuchets. Maybe uh, just fire a will. It's up to you. Uh, and then I've got two more. These also don't have blow up shot. What the hell? Huh. Okay. Okay, these cav units are going to be no problem at all to deal with. Any other abilities I can use? Yeah, morale debuff, why not? Are the generals almost here yet? Almost. Did I even run you over? Yes, I did. Get in there. Alright. Got some cab around. I'm gonna get shot by the towers, but I'll have to suck it up for a bit. So much cab here. All the fucking calf. Okay, back before you get shot by towers. Where the hell are you going? Hello? Uh, you might want to actually just get in there and start doing stuff. And you two. I have my two best actual unit killers standing around doing nothing. Great shit. Alright, I think we actually got this one done, so... Although that unit surprisingly hasn't routed yet, I'm not entirely sure why. There it goes. And that's it. Alright, cool. Quickly get the people who were in range of that up to full elf. Single tick, just bloop. Tops them off. Probably didn't need it, but whatever. Alright, so that should be this faction dead. I'm pretty sure they haven't got any more land, but I actually don't know for sure. It's unlikely though. Oh fuck, of course I can't attack him because of you actually... Oh, no way. Oh, 666. Six, six. This army can't move anymore because I just took the town. Yeah, the faction is indeed dead. We became friends. Relationship lost. Friends. Friends. Lost. Friends. 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 Lost. Friends. Alright. Great shit. So you can't move, which means I have to attack this with you, and then it's gonna run away, or yeah, it'll run away, but I should be able to reach it again. I definitely won't be able to reach that one afterwards, though. Although, this one already ran away, so it's kind of awkward, because I can just kill this one off very easily. Um, maybe I will do that one, because he's kind of trapped over here, and he's taking attrition as well. So yeah, let's kill that one off first, actually. Uh, just make it a normal battle. That's a lot of archers. My goodness, that's five archers, five infantry. Alright. Fight that one too, why don't we? It's not like we got anything better to do. You know what, I'm actually kind of surprised by the, the amount of fighting I'm doing recently and how slow my generals are leveling up. I'm not seeing any level ups except from people who are doing fucking assignments and shit. Even though these same armies are doing battle after battle after battle, it's kind of awkward. Are not leveling up faster. Uh, no blowy up shot in this, unfortunately. That's okay. Uh, no Vanguard deployment or guerrilla deployments, whatever you want to call it. Keep showing ninja deployments. <laughs> Alright. Fire away, boys. They probably have loose formation, judging from the fact that they have two strategists. Yep, they do. It's alright. Where are they going? We're going to get some like, 2k units of cav over here. Get back. Or they're just spreading out and then they're coming towards me. Well, if you let me fire my artillery for a while, I'm totally okay with that. Are you just going to sit back? No, you go. No, no, you go. No, dare you go, I mean. Oh, and they are also in Force March. No, they're not. They are tired already, though. They must have been in some other formation. Like, raiding or whatever. I don't know. 
They're telling you they don't have to kill them all off because they, of course, uh, already ran away. We're out of ammo already. Wow, that was incredibly quickly. Alright, go kill those units. Could have done that suit quicker if I hadn't been triple speeding the entire time. But oh well. Alright. <laughs> you thought you could stand still in front of me, a little bitch? Alright, the heal literally doesn't do anything, so... Alright. That was quick. I feel like I could have probably lost a few less men if I hadn't auto resolved the entire thing. Because it obviously is a lot easier to give more orders in, a sh in, 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 in like when your game isn't triple speeding, but... It's alright. Okay, you can pretend that you survived all you want, but you're dead anyway. Ooh, what do we get? Some shitty thing, alright. A builder... Uh, you know what, I'm gonna start releasing people because... I need to start actually maybe getting peace with some people at some point. So you know what? You can go. Take the revenge man, that money is pretty shit. Alright, so we have enough movement to reach him. But we can't actually attack... Well, we can't reach him again afterwards. If he runs away, which he will probably. No, he won't actually. All right. Well, I'll fight that. Valiant defeat. Are you serious? Pyrrhic victory. Switch that over, didn't we? All right. Fight that one too. Why don't we? Haven't got anything better to do. So yeah, two more trebuchets, which are trash because no explosive shot. Plus they've got loose formation. Yeah, these things don't level up very quickly in regular field battles. It's like the settlement battles where they level up super fast. We can get like a thousand kills per fucking. Per battle, basically, it's pretty insane. Probably not going to triple speed this one as much as I did the other one. Could go on the slope here, but I don't think it's going to really matter that much. Cav all wide again, and generals up front. All right. Okay, I do have crossbows, so we actually got to be somewhat careful here. Our, our range units would get absolutely demolished by those crossbows, so we got to get, get rid of them very quickly with our calf. Uh, how much calf do they have, by the way? They've got one unit there, and that's it. Okay, that's good. So we're going to go over here and kill this fucking dude. Is he want to duel, by the way? He does actually want to duel you, okay. In that case, that's what we'll do. Uh, yep. You can accept it right away. And he's off. Get you guys all a bit wider. That cap unit could become problematic, which is why you're gonna go and kill it. Damn it, why does this happen sometimes? Just don't dismount for some reason. Come on, guys. <laughs> they keep missing each other or something. But they both just have insane melee evasion. Is that what's going on? Well, I guess we're coming. Oh, we got one. Was that me? That was me. Oh, god, are you guys going for my calf? Or protecting against my calf? Let's not do that. Let's not do that, shall we? Yes, I too am very angry. Alright, go kill that one. You come over here. Ugh. Yes, we killed most of the crossbows already. In fact, the entire army is dying. I don't know what the hell is going on. I've been paying attention to these couple of things and somehow the entire enemy army is just thinking about leaving already. I don't know how this happened, but I don't know what you heard about me. Go kill that unit for me. I guess we just destroyed them with crossbows or something. I mean, most of them are really healthy still. I don't want to charge you all with 
到底是无胆鼠辈。那这是 bit of waste. I don't even know. Need, I don't think I even need to use the heal there. There isn't enough to heal. What the fuck are you debuffing before you, little bitch? Ooh. Stationary archer, eh? What? If only was we won with witty words. Yep, he's basically back to full HP, and I think we <laughs> we almost mastered out of the army. What's going on here? This is I mean, this has gone incredibly well. Uh, actually, you go kill this guy or something. I don't know. Even the units on the line kind of broke really quickly. I barely paid attention in this entire battle, and it's just, just one. Go kill the guy who's coming back from running. Go kill him, please. Are you not mounted anymore? Oh, fuck, you're running. God damn it. Where's your mount? All the way back there. You're not gonna beat it or reach anyone if you don't mount up, so. Okay, why haven't we actually won yet? Oh, this guy here. Well, okay. We're killing him, so that's okay. All right, mount back up, boy. Kill him. Are you killing this unit at all? You don't, or this guy? Doesn't appear like you really are. Well, they probably shouldn't fire anyway because my general's there. Eh, it doesn't really matter. You guys, go kill that unit for me, please. There we go. Guess he also had unbreakable. Okay, well, I'm not going to be able to kill much here, to be honest. But I've... Well, yeah, we can't reach the army afterwards either, but they're still taking attrition, so I guess it's okay in the end. Oh, I was just going to say, it'd be great if we could kill him, though. Maybe we'll go kill that unit instead. Maybe even that one. Hmm. Might be able to just about reach this. Oh, I tell, totally forgot, forgot to tell you guys to attack that. Nope, can't. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's just down to these couple last units over here. Kill off a couple more of those. Uh, yeah, alright. Decisive victory. I'd have thought so. It wasn't a decisive defeat predicted. Which was kind of ludicrous to begin with, to be honest, but... Apparently it was. Killed all three generals too. I don't think I actually used my heal in the end, but I don't think we're really that wounded. No, we're not. And we got a thing. Sweet. I'll take the replenishment right now. As much as I want the money as well. Yeah, we can't reach him. I'm not even going to bother going that way. Right. We've got to level up finally. Uh, replenishment's pretty good. You know, morale is not bad. Night battles we currently don't have available. No, we do, right? Pretty sure I've been doing. Yeah, we do have night battles available. Um, armor for the retinue. That's the cav retinue. That's not bad. Melee evasion's all right. Public or um, you know, morale is not bad. Uh, this one gives me battle running speed for cav, which is pretty good. Well, for all in this retinue, but yeah, it's mostly useful for Cav. I kind of like the replenishment though. Although we have a ton of replenishment already, so I think I don't really need that to be honest. So let's go for armor, I think. Or melee evasion. No, he doesn't really need melee evasion. Armor it is. Okay. I don't want to upgrade that. Oh, sworn. Nice. Again, the buff doesn't really do much for us, but still. I just out of curiosity, would you want peace? Wow. What the fuck? Okay. Is that everything I can do except for the army that needs to be recruited? And I don't entirely know where I want to recruit it. Um, this is like the big hurdle. Once we get past this, we're not going to have any... A hard time taking the rest of these towns anymore, I don't think. So I feel like we got this situation pretty well under control. 
I could recruit an army around here to speed this process up, but I feel like as long as we can beat this army, we don't have a stupidly annoying battle in a weird forest, we should be okay there too. Um, over here perhaps would not be a bad idea, but we kind of got this under control as well, I feel like. I don't know, it's a tough decision to make, especially with the Huyi army coming in as well now. We got this northern situation under control, I think, as well. Um, so everything technically, I mean, it sounds like I've got it under control, but that does, that's not necessarily true. I think I'm going to recruit an army over here. I think this is the most iffy situation. You know what, it'll probably just be in this city here, and I can send it up this way and start attacking them right where it hurts. Um, yeah, I think mean, that sounds like a good idea. So let's recruit one in this city here. We built this city. I need to figure out who's going to be the leading dude here. Do we have any... No, no more candidates available. I've recruited all those already because they were really good. Um, right. Let's scroll further down. You guys both weren't ever going to get recruited because you don't have that flaming shot. But I think I'm starting to run out of people who have flaming shots or at least will be okay to use it. You've got uncomplicated, which kind of ruins you. Yeah, you're pretty shit as well. Cowardly. Oh my god, it's got... Yeah, no. Nope. Um, you don't even get the ability, nor do you. You get it, but you're weak. There's something wrong with like all these dudes. You're the best... Well, you don't get the ability either. Do I just give up on Flaming Shot? I mean, the only people that can get it are these guys and they've got shitty traits um, I guess you're the best of the worst Peng Ching because TE is uncomplicated also recruitment cost increase doesn't really sound that good to me alright fine um, it's Peng, Peng Ching is gonna get recruited Alright, you are going to work with... We don't really have many other people, <laughs> like many more healers available either. We've got a guy over here, level 1, so he's not going to be able to recruit Ka for a while, but he also is the only person who's actually a healer right now. There's of course the chance, like the, the option of recruiting captains too, but... I mean, that one is actually not bad, except we just don't get trebuchets, so it's just like... No. Um, so yeah, the only healer we actually have available... Then, then again, we don't necessarily need healers. We can also recruit uh, a veteran to recruit, to use our calf. That's the initial army, right? We got two veterans in here. Uh, we got two veterans and a healer, but the healer's got the infantry of all fucking things. <laughs> what the fuck? Almost wor wondering if I should get rid of her in this army. Recruit someone else um, who can get the calf. Yeah, because here he's got the calf. That is so fucking weird, dude. He's got all the chargey abilities, though. I don't think everyone gets that. Uh, although, I mean, we'll have a look. The veterans that I'm not using because they don't have the right abilities and stuff, maybe they have good chargey abilities. This guy already has a couple of good ones. Um, you got even better ones. See, I could... Oh, you do get Flaming Shot. It's just all the way over there. Hold on. Yeah. But you're leveled up so much already. It's gonna take fucking ages to get there. So I'm still not gonna use him for that. Fatigue resistance. This guy's pretty... Mm, uncomplicated. It's kind of ruins him again. Um, What about other people? For cavalry purely. Like, that's pretty good. But yeah, you're cowardly. You're never gonna get used... You are actually quite close to getting that. But you got bonus from melee infantry, which we don't use, so... Um, I think for now we're just going to use this guy, and then next time, well, we can have a look at that. This guy gets most of the cav bonuses as well, not all of them, though. Okay. And he doesn't get to recruit cav for a while, of course. Alright. And then we are going to recruit as our... Scholar only person that likes everyone which is actually she only likes one person 
he likes both, but he's one of the people I can recruit easily. Eh, I'm tempted to recruit him here anyway. Because he likes both. I can always just recruit someone else. Because they're only 800 bucks. It's not that big a deal. So I'll take you. Are you any good? Uh, sure, you're fine. Right, weapons. Let's give some stuff out. I have loads of those weapons for some reason. Anything in here? Two expertise. I'll have to do. I should have some better stuff in here still, I think. No, we're running out of good shit. I mean, to be fair, I'm recruiting loads and loads of armies. I have a lot of fucking cunning and instinct and authority, which is not what I want. Resolve. Eh, nah. I don't want to, but I'll give him instinct instead. You're gonna get the resolve. No, sorry, you're gonna get instinct as well. And let's see, more instinct. Sure, loose formation, why not? And a weapon, I don't think I've got one for you. You can use a spear instead. Didn't even have a weapon for you either. You're gonna get the cunning. That one. And plus six. Uh, oh my god, an update for me. Snooze the shit out of that. Oh, and that's completely ruined all my recording. Nope, we're good. Okay, never mind. Um, get rid of deployment for his retinue. That's for archers and stuff. Not really a big deal. Reserves, whatever. Let's take the chance of ambush. Why not? And yeah, no weapon for you. But I'll give you a G instead. Or, no, I'll give you the mace. That's fine. All right. Uh, and then we recruit some units, so you're gonna get range units. Let's start with just doing that, 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 that. You're gonna recruit a bunch. Oh, fuck me. Oh, wait, sorry, no, it's the wrong character. I was gonna say, it's not even high enough level to get the regular sword units. That would suck. Um, you're gonna get the calf, but of course, we can't recruit the calf, so let's just recruit spears. Oh, I'm just shy. I'm just shy. That's all right. Damn it. Nope, that's not it either. I can't get this straight. I just don't understand how it works. Someone explained it to me, but it still doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> Wait. That's what I did. Wasn't that one of the first things I did? How is that? Okay, whatever. Okay. And then, yeah, I'll just replace these ones with whatever later on. It doesn't really matter much. Uh, and, of course, I need to replace these ones with more arches, which actually I can't afford one of. Oh, You really are just shy. Okay. That's another army. And now, we're just gonna have to wait to see what happens. We got... A lot of things happening in a lot of different places. But nothing that's currently... Well, I guess the main thing is whatever we're going to get sallied out on here. And what this guy decides to do. Um, but yeah, I'm, I finally understand now why people said that it actually becomes impossible later on if you have the turbans. Um, like, you, you don't have enough generals. I actually didn't think it was going to be a problem because of the amount of people I had, but it turns out I have way more healers than, or way less healers than I've got anything else. I've still got tons of scholars and, uh, and the veterans, but I wouldn't say, I wouldn't even say tons of veterans. I got a couple of veterans. I got mostly, well, there's quite a few down here, just four in a row. It's a lot, still. Like, I can still recruit a, qu quite a few armies, just not with healers anymore. But we don't necessarily need them. Although I think, yeah, this is the only exception to the rule where it doesn't have the calf. And I for some reason made him the, the calf commander. Anyway. Um, let's end the turn. And get wrecked. I think I already checked all the diplomacy. There's not anything interesting here. Don't want peace out with Cao Cao because he's the only faction I can currently destroy. Although he's... Moving up many armies. Oh, okay, we're being besieged there. I think that's a 2v1. I can bring my second army over, but again, that is Liu Bei. Cao Cao becoming annoying running around. Tsai Mao is attacking us, right? Well, we kind of expected that. That's exactly what we wanted, actually. It still looks like he have the has the upper hand here. Oh, I still haven't got that second trebuchet, and I don't have explosive shot here either. 
So this won't be an easy battle, but it's definitely doable. Now, the garrison's not even in the fight either, so it should be even easier than it initially was going to be, even though this army isn't now in Force March anymore. Maybe we can get our item back. Did any of them equip it? That would have been even more fucking salt in the wound, but they didn't. Right, we'll find out next time. Until then, have a good day, and goodbye.